Okay, hello, Andrew. Hello, Lola. Thank you for joining us today. So let's start with an easy question. Can you please briefly introduce yourself and Neom so you can tell us about your role and projects that are furthering food tech for thoughts uh, in the region? My name is Andrew Yip. I work at Neom leading the technology and innovation practice in the food sector, and I'm a proud CIF fellow. Projects that are of interest, I would say there are two things that uh, catch my attention these days. One is the food tech accelerator that we're developing at Neom Food, where they believe that Neom can de- be their trustworthy partner on their journey. Our second project uh, revolves around open innovation challenges and how to bring global innovators big and small in addressing essential challenges in food in the Middle East around food production specifically, and also how we keep food fresh, sustainable, and healthy in the context of Neom. Amazing, amazing. Uh, that's, that's a great answer. Angel Rising is happening in two weeks. What should Angel Rising participants look forward to from your session? I believe that participants can look for very fruitful and thought-provoking conversations at the panel, and also some exciting announcements from Neom. Hey, now we're all looking forward to it. (laughs) Can you tell us about a podcast or a blog or a book that you came across recently that inspired you? Yes, so about the book that I've been uh, very interested in in the food world, it's actually by uh, a former colleague of mine at Neom called Jessica Ice. She wrote a book on how to feed the world, and it brings in a communications perspective on how people think the world should be fed and how the communications gap is making it very difficult. That is super interesting. Any ideas or any insights from that book? Yes. So uh, a key insight that I realized is that food innovation at the heart is not a technology play. It is a human-centered and human-centered design play, and the core of which is communications. When we are talking about technology adoption, when we are talking about consumer awareness, it's all about how we design around the human needs. So I truly believe that the next wave of food innovation is not about technologies in both bio or digital sense, but really how we can design the food system better for the humans that is centered to it. 100% agree. I have one more question. What are you most excited for in the future of food tech, whether that's regionally or globally? At Neom, uh, we have four or five areas of uh, industry focus uh, that we look at across production and supply chain and also downstream consumption uh, for citizens' experience. What I'm most interested in would be how we bring the innovations into people's home. I am also looking forward to the technologies that I can bring into my kitchen.